Hello everybody, welcome to This Way Out World. My name is Jerome and in this video it's going to be a bit of a musical one. Recently I went to the MENT Music Festival in Slovenia, Ljubljana, and it's like a three-day festival based in the city. And I saw some incredible bands and one of my highlights is seeing these guys, Lenny Klavak. Lenny Klavak, they're like a gypsy punk, uh, cross-genre, energetic, just really buzzing band. And um, well, you might as well just see the clips and see what they like. Followed, followed by an interview with them. Enjoy. Hi, I'm Gregor. I'm from Slovenia. Uh, hi, uh, we're all from the band Leni Kravac. I'm Matija and I'm from Slovenia. Hey, my name is Tamara. I'm also from Slovenia and also part of Leni Kravac's band. And I'm Grega. I'm the drummer of uh, this uh, crazy band, as you see. Well, it all started as a DJ project a long, long time ago. And then Greg and I met uh, working for the same TV television station and uh, we decided to make a band. So it was a three-piece and we've always aspired to grow the band into something bigger and with a live brass section. Tamara and I met. At the karaoke in one bar and we started talking and I told him that I'm a singer and I'm singing in this band now. <laughs> yeah, well, I actually got invited by the trumpet player. Trumpet player Gaspar called me if I wanted to come like come around and play a bit with them and we kind of went on from there it was pretty pretty much uh, like yeah. that it was one practice with him and yeah. we were just okay you're, you're in. in the band you're in. <laughs> <laughs> actually uh, how we met with uh, matthew we were actually the editors for the, for the news and he was like oh okay i'm drum and bass oh i also like drum and bass and you are the the dj oh i would like to know about uh, which music do you prefer? And he said, oh, I like the Balkan drum and bass. And I said, oh, Balkan, because I'm, I'm more of a like, punk rock guy and metal stuff, and I like heavy beats, and he, he was like, yeah, but I also play bass. And I was ah, I'm a drummer. We can go like, uh, we can make a rehearsal. And this is how we started, and then the, this guy, Johnny, came with the guitar, and it was a trio, so everything else is history. <laughs> how did you come to creating your sounds? Well, I guess we all come from a different musical background, which is what makes our blend of sounds so unique and different. Because um, I come from the UK electronic scene, like I started off with drum bass and then some dubstep. Uh, I used to be a metalhead as well. Then you've got Greggy, who's, well, punk rock, uh, <laughs> metal and 80s yeah, yeah. synth pop. Uh, <laughs> then Tamara, she's like uh, everything. Jukebox, they call me Jukebox. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she she, she knows uh, around 500 songs of uh, like Balkan area and not just Balkan. Uh, also everything. Yeah, she's, she's like a Jukebox. Yeah. Actually 1500. Uh, we've yeah. got Yaka, a hip hop producer as well, uh, and plays the sax for in various different genres. We've got uh, Gasper on the trumpet, who's a classically trained musician. And then we've got... The yeah, I'm more like a started from blues i guess with the classic guitar player uh, road and uh, then connected to the balkan side of me through this band and it's i just love it so yeah when you mix all of this together you get the sound of lenny kravitz we start having fun in the van driving there <laughs> and then all sorts of things happen like we lose this the other singer Mila, Milan and we lose the saxophone player because they go off drinking with some Russian chick they met in Tal. We don't know if they're even going to come to the concert until they finally arrive 10 minutes before we have to go on stage and it's like, oh my god. Where do, would you love to go um, play out in your band? Anywhere in the world, you have a free ticket right here. Where would you want to play? Hmm. I think Exit. Exit Festival, yeah. okay. 
I say Japan, man. It's always been a dream of mine to play in Japan because supposedly the audience there is just That's crazy. True. That's true. It's. I was told it's the best experience you can have, like being a band. Well, I think U.S. and Canada. Uh, and then I'll go for Africa. I heard they have a really good uh, rock and roll metal stuff concerts. I've I've seen a few documentaries, and uh, I think we are the, we are the perfect for <laughs> that kind of people. <laughs> well, that's it for now. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that interview and those bunch of clips from Lenny Glavak. I hope you uh, subscribe, check me out on Instagram and on Twitter, and look out for the next series of videos. Um, I think on top of the list is a quick overview of the MENT Music Festival itself, and I also interviewed a few more bands, as well as look out for my Silk Road Part 2 video. If you want to see all of that, subscribe. And any comments, i love to hear what you think about this video channel so far. And well, I'll see you guys later. Bye!